Hey guys, Master of Extreme 93, part 14 of Emerald. I did not want to be unprofessional and have two consecutive episodes of non-narrating, of non-voice narrating, and to be honest, I probably should not be talking yet because my voice is not fully healed, and I've still got a, quite a scratchy voice. But, again, I did not want to be unprof unprofessional and go two straight episodes without narrating, so I will try to be as positive as I can, I will try to be as, as good of a narrator as I can for this episode, just bear with me, my voice still hurts, my throat still hurts, so it's not going to be an amazing narration, put it that way. And we're just finishing up with trainer battles on this route. And the good thing about this route is that Right here, we're going to, well not in this battle, but on this route, we're going to catch our last team member. So by the end of this episode, we're going to have all six of our team members. Which is pretty good. And that's why I'm not cutting out these wild battles, because I'm looking for a certain Pokemon. Fight this parasol chick. Apparently, she has a double. She won't be too hard. Just keep using Absorb. I think it's pretty cool that my channel, The Mad Gamers, has gotten like, I don't know, close to 100 subscribers now and it's been less than a week. I think that's pretty kick-ass. I'll continually, I will continually plug the channel and my voice narrations until you people subscribe to it. I'm going to be very, very persistent. Go subscribe to To Mad Gamers. It's in my channel box for slot. It is a great channel. I recommend it 100%. I'm trying not to be biased here. Obviously, I'm going to say that it's awesome since I'm the owner of the channel, but seriously, we're doing a wide variety. We've got Pokemon, we've got Kingdom Kingdom Hearts, we've got some guy who... Oh, here we go! This is what I wanted. A Skarmory. This is going to be our last team member. And that was just, as I was saying, we got Kingdom Hearts, we got Pokemon, and we got somebody else doing Minecraft, I think. So we've got a little bit of everything. So please, subscribe to it. It's worth your time. And also worth my time right now is this battle, because we're going to try and catch this Skarmory. And it's also good that it's male, because if I want to nickname it, it probably needs it to be male in order to nickname it like that. Alright, so Calm Mind, Confusion, do some decent damage, hopefully. That's pretty good. Oh, we got confused. That's good. Yeah, that's right. Hit yourself in your confusion. I'll just start chucking some great balls. Come on. You know you want to be caught. One, two, three. Epic. We get it on the first Pokeball. And so we get Skarmory. Skarmory is a beast. Defensively, it's a tank. And the fact that it's a steel type means it's even more of a tank since steel is such a good resistance typing. A little lacking on the special defensive side, but who cares? And of course, I will nickname it Tier because Tier is awesome. All right, I was thinking about naming it something else, but Tier deserves a name. He hasn't gotten a name before, so there you go, Tier. You get your own name. As I was saying, good things about Skarmory. He's got it's good physical defense plus steel typing, so it's a tank. Lacking special defense wise. Especially since its only weaknesses in this game are only fire and electricity, which is also good because of its few 
weaknesses, but its weaknesses it does have usually is very deadly since both electric and fire types of moves in this game are special attacks, I believe. So that kind of couples with the bad special defense, and so it's a little bit vulnerable to its few weaknesses. A decent attack, nothing that'll blow you away, but the attack is, doesn't have to be great since the defense is great. And a little bit slow also, but most tanks are slow, so that's to be expected. But it does even get the move agility, so even with agility, it can be a speedy, a speedy tank. And now we got this double battle, taking out these two spindas. And so that's it for this double battle. The spindas go down. To my amazement, I have not started coughing on this narration, and I could have swore when I started and my throat hurts so bad I was going to start coughing, but apparently my throat has not been irritated enough yet to start hacking up phlegm or something like that, so yeah, that's good, that's good news, I guess. And now we got this ninja person, he's going to throw out coughing. Speaking of fucking coughing, I mean, come on, seriously. Well, I'll use Screech and then use Quick Attack. I thought at first Screech plus Pursue would be good since Pursue I thought was physical. But after realizing, wait, it's a Dark type. Dark type moves in this game are special, I think. So Pursue doesn't do anything to Screech. Quick Attack locally does. I'll go with Screech, so that's okay. Level 26 for Grow Vials, we'll back out to Vaporeon to take out the rest of these. Coughings that he has, that he has. Now I'm sorry if you can't hardly hear my voice. I can't tell if I'm talking too quietly or something because of my voice. I really hope that my voice gets better by tomorrow because... Well, actually, hold on. I'm not sure. I was going to say I hope my voice gets better by tomorrow so I can make another normal video and narrate it normally. But I just remembered I'm not going to be able to make a Emerald video tomorrow because I'm going to be at my grandma's house. And I can't record a video if I'm at my grandma's house. So forget about that. I'm sorry. Also, I guess that could be a heads up. I'm not going to be making no videos tomorrow because I won't be here. So yeah, I apologize, but I promise part 15 of Emerald will be on Sunday. Not Sunday, Saturday. That's what I'm going to say. Part 15 will be on Saturday. And now we just got this noob with an air on, so just use Water Guard, and it will go down. And I recently hit 2.2k subscribers on my main account. I thank you guys so much. Hoping to get 2.3 sooner than later. Never really seriously thought that my Master of Extreme 93 account would be this successful, ever. Like, I thought 500 subs was amazing, then 1,000, then 1,500, then 2,000, now almost, what, 2,500 almost now? It's crazy. It's just crazy. Can't do it without you guys, though, obviously. None of this would, would be possible if it wasn't for you guys clicking the subscribe button, so I thank you so much. It makes me want to make videos knowing that I have people like you who think my videos are somewhat decent, I mean, seriously. I don't think highly of my videos, but then to see everybody watching and get all these subscribers, it makes me feel good that I decided to do this as a hobby because it's awesome. It's awesome to please you guys, I guess, and that's why I do what I do, that's why I make my diamond walkthrough, that's why I made I made emerald, that's why I made yellow. And in case you did not know, I'm redoing crystal. A few of you a few of you might remember that I once tried crystal, I believe it was the first one I ever tried. But my ROM got corrupted. And I gave up after that and that's why I started with diamond. But I'm redoing crystal and it's been pretty fun so far. So it's on to Mad Gamers. Another reason why I think you should go check out the channel subscribe because I'll be doing crystal on that channel and yeah sorry for getting to this this rant I guess you could say I need just keep going on and on and on and on 
but nothing else to really talk about because we just got a lot of trainer battles right now, so it's the only thing I can think about. Just waiting for part 15 because I'm part 15 of Emerald, I know for a fact Volkner is going to hit level 26 and then level 26 is going to be epic for Volkner. Obviously, because it will, it's going to evolve finally, and I have to check on Bulpedia, what level Kyle evolves. So yeah, hoping that next episode will, will be awesome like that. To finally get some fully evolved Pokemon. So once they get fully evolved, they just start raping everything. I want to go to the PC to get on my Skarmory, and this chick's blocking the entrance. I didn't need to use the Pokemon storage system that you developed. That's still that's a fucking lie. You did not develop the, the Pokemon storage system, or whatever it's called. Bill made that. Oh, so your name's Lynette. Lynette. I don't give a fuck what your name is, okay? Bill made the PC. The GTFO Lynette. Try to take credit for Bill's work. How dare you? All right, so let's get out our Skarmory. And if you're wondering why I have a Heracross, all I did was hack the ROM to get a Heracross for Rock Smash. That's all I did. Yeah, who gives a fuck? I needed a Rock Smash HM Slay, so I got a Heracross. Don't know why specifically a Heracross, I just thought Heracrosses are cool. So let's just heal up and let's continue on. By the way, this is some city. Uh, Ball Arbor Town. That's what it's called. Another small city, another Pokemon contest place. And this is where you can turn in heart scales to reteach moves. What's this house? A fossil maniac. Okay, I don't care about that. And now just west of Fall Arbor Town and just got some trainer battles. And if you're wondering where we're going, because the past couple of cities have not had gems in the cities. Uh, there's something you have to do in order to access the next city, which has the fourth gem, and you're going to be seeing what that thing is within the next couple of episodes. And as you can see, this battle is just a Barboche versus Tear, the Skarmory. So just use Peck, and it goes down. And I think my voice is just feeling already better by just talking out loud. I guess that's one of the things that I should have done begin with is that when my voice was feeling bad I wasn't talking hardly in real life. I was just like not saying anything. And after having talked for a while, my voice feels a little bit better, so I guess that's a good sign. That noob gives you the team up for roar and now we have a double battle. And I guess I'm gonna stop the recording after this double battle since there's not much else to do for now. A nose leaf and a barboach. This should be easy. Throw out Skarmory and Numble. Use Peck on nose leaf and use Magnitude. Magnitude is just going to be, be be a troll move because it won't affect Skarmory. It'll only hit Barboach. That's funny. So let's see. Kyle used Magnitude. Magnitude 9, that's good. It doesn't affect Skarmory. Just rape. I mean, it doesn't affect Skarmory, and it's a Magnitude 9. That's just overkill. Go down, Barboach. You suck. Well, I apologize if this was a painful video to listen to. My fault. But Mox signing out. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.